So you guys know Megan Thee Stallion and Glorilla have been on tour for a little minute now. So there's a video that's going viral of Megan Thee Stallion having some empty seats and now people are basically saying that Megan Thee Stallion is being exposed for having empty seats and not selling out her tour. So one person tweeted and said not Megan wanted her to cut the vid cause she didn't want all those empty seats caught in 4k but user Hottie the Thotty told me she was in high demand. And then someone else said a fan is going viral for exposing Megan's tour for being empty. You can see Megan begging her to stop recording. Now there is another video that's going around but I'm not exactly sure if this was before the concert or after the concert. Now this Twitter user decided to take up for Megan Thee Stallion said Megan had a sold out show on Monday with less than 24 hour notice and that beat was packed like a can of sardines. I knew it would be a hang ace somewhere so I made sure to get proof and this is the video that this Twitter user posted. Well, you guys, let me know your thoughts and opinions on that down in the comment section below. I'm moving on to the next topic. So, Sukiyana recently sat down with Matt Hoffa, hopefully I'm pronouncing his name right, and she basically talked about why she decided to diss JT. Now, you guys know JT did release her song, OK, and Sukiyana felt like certain lyrics was talking about her. So, JT lyrics went Maserati Mommy and the Roof Missing, Shade Crab Legs, now her whole tooth missing, Cheap A Veneers, You Stay Talking Ish, Put a market to this bee she's so counterfeit now there's only two people who lost their veneers now Sukiana lost her veneers eating crab legs and cardi b lost her veneer but she lost her veneer by eating a hard bagel at this point i don't want to pay no 20 30 000 for no teeth if i can't eat crab legs bitch where's my tooth like where is my tooth why would i crab legs how i can't eat crab crawl and at this point, I feel like bitches is hating. Because where is my tool? What y'all stole it? Y'all still in teeth now? I got shows to do. Who stole my tooth? I'm in Oakland. Where is my where? What's going to happen with my teeth? I don't want motherfuckers. <laughs> So when JT's song OK came out, Sukiyana was in jail. So when Sukiyana came out, she said a lot of people was tagging her and basically saying that JT was talking about her. So Sukiyana made a video and basically told JT, can you please let everybody know that you wasn't talking about me? I don't feel like you was talking about me, but just let everybody know that you wasn't talking about me in your song. I just want to clear this up real quick because I was locked up when the song came out. I come home, I look at my phone, everybody keep tagging me. They keep tagging me. And they tagging Cardi too. They said JT was trying to diss me in a song or Cardi B. So she said said in a song um a bitch broke her cheap ass veneers on some crab legs and she always be talking shit i did now we all know i don't broke my, my my teeth on some crab legs i love crab legs shit that's normal shit i ain't have to post it i post because i'm a real bitch and i live my truth but i don't talk shit about bitches I, I i always show love never hate on a bitch never called a bitch name always show love and i was at jt birthday party it was hugs and giggles so i don't feel like she's talking about me and i don't take her as the girl that just start trouble with random people when she dropping a song so they say there's trouble in paradise for her and cardi y'all bitches trying to hype me up to roast the bitch i ain't even, I, I i can't i ain't going i, I miss ain't going you feel me like jt just clear it up because i know you see the people keep tagging me and cardi They're only tagging me and her can you let us know who you're talking about because i know cardi dropped broke her tooth on a uh, bagel but I just don't feel like I just don't feel like me and you got no Tino shade. So then let me know. Well, JT didn't clear up anything, and Sukiyana decided to diss JT, and she came out with a song called Coca Cola. They got into it. They went back and forth. But you guys go ahead and listen to what Sukiyana has to say about why she decided to diss JT. A lot of bass. Yo, what happened? What happened between you and JT? Like, like, what's, what, what's going on right now? Honestly, um. I don't, I, I just, the people were, the, she had a song that she dropped, mm -hmm. which I do love, by the way, mm -hmm. but um, it was a line in it that said a bitch broke her tooth on a crab leg. So the the internet kind of went to a frenzy and was trying to figure out who was she talking about because it was very detailed. And I'm one of the people that proudly went live and said, I broke my tooth on a crab, crab leg. leg. Mm -hmm. But then we also had um, Cardi that broke her tooth on a bagel. 
So the people were tagging me and Cardi the, a lot, all in the comments, like the whole song, just me and Cardi. Right. So um, I when I came home, I seen it and um, I finally said something. The people keep bothering me. It was Suki, this about you, this about you. So I publicly asked her, you feel me? Right. Who, who, who is it about? I don't feel like it's about me, but I would appreciate you if you just tell them that it's not about me so I don't be connected to it, you feel me? Right. But um, she did it, you know, and... Um, she did what? what did she, she did. Do? She, no, she, she didn't clarify. She didn't clarify. She didn't clarify. Well, she that. doesn't have to. That's not. She don't have to. I, I, honestly, well, me. If somebody asks me to clarify something, I'm gonna clarify. If it's for, it, me, I'm a very directed person. So if I got something for you, it's going straight to you with your name on it in a present, like it's yours. Right. So um, I, I personally don't feel no type of way that she didn't say who it was about but at the end of the day if the shoe fit for me i'm wearing it i take accountability for everything i do so if it fit my foot i don't give a fuck who it was for if it fit my foot i'm aware right. so um that's just how that went and you know i didn't really want to do the internet thing because like people know me for roasting people mm -hmm. you know so i felt like i'm i'm a new artist and i got a lot to prove I'm a big hip hop fan, so I felt like all that back and forth shit, I could roast you right here. But if I roast you right here, then roast you in this song, they gonna say, I already did that online. I already said everything. So um, I just kept it to myself. I was at uh, Rick Ross's birthday, Rick, Rick Ross's sister birthday party. Right. That's when I found out like, oh, it's getting real. So I flew straight from the club home, got straight in the studio, just put it in, put it in my, my uh, music, you know, how I felt. And, um, that's it. I, I like how Suki said, you know, she didn't have to clear up anything, but if it was me, I would have cleared it up. At the end of the day, I feel like if you're not talking about somebody and that person really feels like you was talking about them, I don't think there's anything wrong with clearing it up or getting on social media or even texting Suki or DMing Suki like, hey, the song wasn't about you, this, that, and the third. But I feel like if she would have came to social media and said, oh, I wasn't talking about Suki, then a lot of people would have been like, well, who are you talking about? And a lot of people already said she could be talking about anybody. Like I said, some people did think she was talking about cardi b but then cardi b broke her veneer by eating a bagel and not a crab leg so that wouldn't have went for cardi b but in my opinion like i said if jt would have just cleared it up or dm'd suki like hey suki i wasn't talking about you they wouldn't have been beefing and there wouldn't have been suki on making a diss track against jt but anyways you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions on this down in the comment section below make sure you guys like share subscribe hit the notification bell and i will talk to you guys in the next video